using a bomber is sometimes vital for the defense sources and country to win the war or to reduce the power of our enemy country. A combat aircraft designed to attack ground and naval targets by dropping air-to-surface weaponry such as bombs or launching torpedoes or deploying air-launched cruise missile is known as the bomber. There are two major classifications of bomber which is strategic and tactical bombing. The strategic bombing is done by heavy bombers primarily designed for long-range bombing missions against the strategic targets such as supply bases, bridges, factories, shipyards and cities themselves. This is to diminish the enemy's ability to wage war by limiting access to resources through crippling infrastructure or reducing the industrial output. Now coming to tactical bombing, it's an aerial bombing aimed at targets of immediate military value such as combatants, military installations or military equipments. This is in contrast to strategic bombing or attacking enemy cities and factories to cripple the future military production and enemy civilians. Today in this video we are going to discuss about the new modernized missile carrying bomber of Russia. Yes, I'm talking about the Russia's newest modernized missile carrying bomber TU-160M which has conducted its first test flight successfully on February 2, 2020. The first flight of the first deeply modernized TU-160M prototype bomber based on the TU-160 combat aircraft took place at the KAZ airfield. The flight proceeded at an altitude of 1500 meters and lasted for 37 minutes. The TU-160 aircraft employs a fly-by-wire control system with a blended wing profile. The full span slats are used on the leading edges with double slotted flaps on the trailing edges and it also has a cruciform tail design. The TU-160 has a crew of four members which includes pilot, co-pilot, bombardier and a defensive system operator. Now coming to TU-160M, it has been developed under the program of heavy upgrade of operational TU-160 bombers. The aircraft's new version is to considerably boost the plane's efficiency when it is employed according to its designation. It features an upgraded onboard defense system, an advanced communication system, new engines and weaponry that significantly expand the bomber's performance and strike capability. During the first flight, the necessary checks were performed on updated systems and equipment installed as part of the deep modernization of the aircraft. According to the crew, the flight went as normal, the systems and equipment worked without any remarks. The Russian Defense Minister Sergei Soigu said at a meeting in Kazan in January 2020 that the first serial production heavily upgraded Tu-160M strategic bomber would arrive for the troops in 2021. So this was an update on the first successful test flight of modernized Tu-160M strategic bomber. Thanks for watching. I'll upload another video with a new defense update later. Please do subscribe my channel and hit the bell button next to it. And also feel free to leave a comment in the comment section. Thank you.